Today on Engineering Newswire, we're exploring the moon with Audi, shedding new light on solar energy in the dark, and building a bulletproof car seat. Almost 45 years after NASA's Apollo 17 completed the last manned mission to the moon, the Google Lunar X Prize competition has selected the same landing site for its rover showdown. Winners of the Google Lunar X Prize must place a robot on the moon's surface and explore at least 500 meters while transmitting high-def video and images back to Earth for the chance to win $30 million. Joining the competition, Audi has teamed up with the German team the part-time scientists. Audi is supporting the team with its knowledge in lightweight construction and e-mobility, specifically with its Quattro permanent all-wheel drive and with piloted driving. The company is also providing assistance in testing trials and quality assurance. The vehicle, dubbed the Audi Lunar Quattro, is largely made of aluminum and features an adjustable solar panel to capture sunlight that is directed to a lithium-ion battery to power four electric wheel hub motors. The Quattro's theoretical max speed is 3.6 kilometers per hour, or about two miles per hour. Which doesn't sound that fast, but the company stresses that the vehicle's off-road capabilities and ability for safe orientation are more important. The Google Learner X Prize, which started off with more than 25 teams, is currently in its final round. A new energy cell has been designed to store large-scale solar energy, even in the dark. The University of Texas at Arlington Materials Science and Engineering team has developed an all-vanadium photoelectrochemical flow cell that allows for efficient and large-scale solar energy storage, even past my bedtime, which uh, tends to vary every now and then. Now all the team has to do is what Texas is best known for, make it bigger. The work is a product of the 2013 National Science Foundation's $400,000 grant to improve the way solar energy is captured, stored, and transmitted for use. According to team leader Dong Lu, the group has demonstrated simultaneously reversible storage of both solar energy and electrons in the cell. The release of the stored electrons under dark conditions continues solar energy storage, thus allowing for unintermittent storage around the clock. The research may promise solar energy storage at a much higher capacity and a much larger scale. Latvian military-grade vehicle manufacturer Darts Motors is known for creating luxurious, impenetrable armored vehicles. Some, like the Black Shark Spy Car, even feature rotating bulletproof grills, Kevlar-coated titanium bodies, and an anti-paparazzi shock device. And now the company has developed a bulletproof child car seat. Wait, what? Yep, that's what I said. Called the L'Enfante Terrible Car Seat, the product features Kevlar gold-plated crocodile skin and gold-stitched carbon fiber. According to Dart, one of their paranoid customers ordered the bulletproof car seat for their child. The press release so eloquently explained, Dear parents, we encourage you not to save pennies on your precious child when you splurge 500,000 to a million on your own car. Pretty outlandish, right? In fact, the Napa leather-clad chairs are even connected by means of an audio input from mobile devices. Yep, that's right. The baby gets an integrated speaker in the headrest in addition to massagers, ventilation, and electric positioning functions. The company hasn't disclosed how much the car seat costs or who even purchased it. But if you're requesting a gold-plated car seat for your child, money is probably the least of your concerns. Do you have store ideas? Comment below and we'll cover them in an upcoming episode. For the PD&D channel, I'm Melissa Plasmunder and this has been your Engineering Newswire.